whether you're a Paul George fan, whether you hate OKC, I want everyone's honest opinion. Should OKC trade Paul George? Because right now the Thunder, they're playing bad. Right now, OKC is 12 and 14, which is not a good record by any means. That's bad for a team that has three All-Stars in Paul George, Melo, Russ. That means they're having trouble figuring it out. So I don't see Paul George staying on the Thunder because they're playing bad. Now the Thunder, they can trade Paul George or wait until he's a free agent where he decides where he wants to go. But of course, if he leaves the Thunder because they're not a great team, PG, he walks out and the Thunder get nothing. Like So right now, OKC is playing bad. And the problem is they only have two months. So they're on the clock, they're on the deadline. Right now, they haven't been playing great. And I don't think that in the next two months, they can convince Paul George that they're a great team. In this game, they lost to the Hornets and they struggled with the Pacers. So you really think they're going to beat the Warriors in the Western Conference Finals if they get there? I don't think so. I don't really think they're going to get to the Western Conference Finals because they don't have a bench. Russell Westbrook is trying to make poor George and Carmelo Anthony happy because after this season, they can walk. Poor George and Carmelo Anthony, they're going to be free agents. So Russell Westbrook, he's trying his best to pass them the ball to make them comfortable and happy. But at the same time, Russell Westbrook is forgetting that he needs to score. They're playing hero ball. Russell Westbrook is forgetting that there's other players on the team besides poor George and Carmelo Anthony. And because Russell Westbrook is so busy trying to make Melo and Paul George happy, the team is losing. So here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking OKC should trade Paul George because think about it. The reason why Kevin Durant left OKC is because he knew that if he did beat the Warriors when he was up 3-1 in the Western Conference Finals, he wasn't going to get that chance ever again. He would have won one ring and that's it. Now the Thunder, they can gamble. They can say, you know what? We believe that Paul George is going to stay. He's going to be happy for him to resign for like five years or two years or one year, whatever it is. They can gamble and say, you know what? We're not going to try to trade or entertain trading Paul George. We're going to wait till he's a free agent because we're confident that he's going to resign. Now, of course, the Thunder can try to trade Carmelo Anthony, but I don't think anybody wants Carmelo Anthony because they've seen the problems that he causes to whatever team he joins. When he was on the Knicks, he wanted the ball all the time. He went to the Thunder and he wants the ball all the time. And he's getting up there in age, so nobody really wants him. If if the Thunder can trade Kamala Anthony, you'd have to come off the bench for whatever team that wants him. And I don't think Melo wants that deal. But of course, if he's being traded, he has no choice. A team that has a big three should not be 12 and 14. That means they're having trouble figuring it out. But you guys tell me what you think in the comment section. Should OKC trade Paul George? And I'm out.